know there are pastors watching Ronnie right now, and, and, and they're saying, you know, you know we're going through, uh, we're almost underwater. Give us a word of faith mm -hmm. to let them know that this God that started us out at the, at the beginning of the Red Sea when it opened is the same God that's going to get us out the other side, even though Pharaoh is breathing down our necks. Speak to those pastors today, if you could, and give them a rhema that there's hope in this situation, that God is working all things together for his good. Share with us. You remember when Nehemiah was building the wall, Sanballat and Tobias came, and they had an orchestrated attack, Absolutely. a strategy. And the strategy was, if we can get him to meet with us, if we can pretend that we're on his team, that we just want to talk to him, if we can just get him distracted, we can have our way with him. And you remember what it says in Nehemiah 6. It says, listen, I'm not leaving what I'm called to do, to go down yes. and does these things with you. I don't have time Mom. to mess with you. I speak that over these pastors. When the enemy comes and whispers, you're a failure, you need to quit, your church is going under, you're not called to do this anymore, why do this, why deal with all this division, this demonic activity, you need to say, listen, devil, I don't have time to go down to the pit where you are and leave the mission and the mandate that God has called me to. Pastor, if you're watching this, I want to say to you, keep going, keep dreaming, keep witnessing. Keep preaching. Keep loving. Keep Absolutely. sowing. Yes. Don't give up on the kingdom of God because I'm telling you, your work will be finished. Your dreams will come to pass. You've got to look at things. Hallelujah. The eyes. You may not complete every task that you had a vision of or a dream of, but your children's children may finish the work God's called you to. And they're watching right now in this difficult season to see if yes. you will stay faithful. And I am preaching to myself as much as I'm preaching to you. We must keep going. We must keep dreaming. We must stay faithful. We cannot give up on the mission that God has called us to in this season. This is not a time for cowards. This is no, not sir. a time for This is not a time for lazy people. We've got to dig our heels in. And we've got to lift up the name that is above every name. Hallelujah. And Lord of Lords. And I believe, Philip, with all my heart, if you'll lift him up yes. and our faith will be in him, not in politics or not in anything that has to do with humanity, if we'll lift Jesus up, we're going to see the greatest revival over the course of the next two years. 